your eyes Get some rest I'm by your side Lay your head on my chest everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome to another vlog of course i have the twins here um i'm by myself currently you're cheeky they're they're really starting to like almost giggle now it's so cute do you want your dummy they've just had an app excuse all the washing obviously everywhere but yeah i thought i could film over the next few days um i'm actually going to kent this weekend so it might be in this vlog or another vlog i'm not sure yet but we're gonna go for i think we're staying for two nights it's weird Romy's usually the more chilled twin but today you're a bit needy with mummy aren't you you just want me all the time which i'm not gonna lie i love it's just hard when they're both like that that's when you're like oh my god <laughs> how do i do this by myself but yeah we're gonna go to kent this weekend to see my family and um, which would be really lovely so i just thought i could pick the camera up again as usual as and when <laughs> as and when i can um but yeah they're slowly getting to a better routine now so so i know like they have a morning nap and then when we put them down at night they tend to like stay asleep until the next like middle of the night feed um, so their routine is getting a lot better, like slowly but surely, uh, which is making my life so much easier because honestly guys, like working and anything like that has just been so difficult because my hands are so full <laughs> and obviously our family do come and help, but they've obviously got jobs. So there are times where it's a little bit more stressful, but I just know already like it's gone so fast and they're going to be in a proper routine in no time so it's fine. I'm just going to check the weather. I feel like because they've woken up from their nap and they're still really tired. I think I'm going to take them out for a walk actually. I think I'm going to do that then come home so that's the plan. Hi guys, I'm just finishing getting ready for the day. I just thought I would speak about this because it's just kind of how I'm feeling at the minute. Um, my anxiety at the minute is very heightened and I just feel like it's nothing to do with the twins. It's nothing to do with like things in particular. It's kind of just everything. It feels a lot at the minute. It feels very heavy. I don't have to describe it. Like, obviously I'm so grateful for everything, but as soon as like the twins go down for a nap i'm then doing the next thing i'm then filming i'm then working i'm then doing housework and then it's just it kind of feels like i don't stop at all at the minute and i think i'm just really struggling a little to be honest with you i think i'm also doing my period which doesn't help as well um but i just but yeah i just feel like i'm trying to do a million things at once and it's just a lot and i know this is only like a short period of my life where everything kind of feels like this and i think once the twins are more of a routine it'll be a lot easier to juggle but like look <laughs> i just feel like my house is a mess at the minute and everything is just very messy and it makes my mind feel really messy and i feel like it's just so hard to try and be organized with everything because i'm trying to be organized with the twins and trying to yeah get work done and all that kind of stuff so sorry if it seems like i'm a little bit like at the minute of everything but it's just it's kind of how i'm feeling and as much as i love my job obviously i don't get maternity leave so it's kind of hard in that sense that i just need to keep going and just work as i would have before with a lot shorter frame time to do it all in <laughs> so it's just making it a little bit hard at the minute but you know we're getting there <laughs> slowly but surely oh, i think that's why i'm really excited to go to kent this evening because i just i think i need to just get away from like my daily reality just because it just feels very heavy at the minute and i think i need some time to just not think about it all if that makes sense not in a horrible way but in a way that i just kind of need to breathe a little bit so yeah i'm excited to go to kent um i need to pack my stuff and the twin stuff and probably some of bradley's stuff today um because we literally leave in 
about three hours time <laughs> so i need to make sure that everything's done and um, so yeah oh it's just a lot but it is what it is but i'm right here it's gonna be okay good morning everyone so we are in kent today it's now the next day we are in kent this is my outfit of the day and i think we're gonna go to blue water have a little mutual round and i can take you guys along with me i'm with a lot of my family today which is really exciting um, the twins are currently downstairs with my mum and my uncle and my cousins so so yeah i've quickly got dressed for the day um and then yeah we're gonna head to blue water and have a really lovely day it's such a nice day today as well the sun is out so it's a really lovely day and i'm just feeling so like happy which is really nice <laughs> Maddie's got Romy. I can tell. <laughs> Say hi, Mum. She gets all good. <laughs> Brode's doing Marley's nappy. <laughs> Let's see who else is here. Yeah. 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 I'm just that normal. Yeah, I'm that normal. Amy, have I ever told you how? <laughs> Right, we're at Uncle Kevin's house. <laughs> this is the kids' creek. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> what? Come to me, Dad. What does that mean? Yeah, I don't get it. Come to me, Dad. Right, I need to pack the milk. I want to do a collab with um, <laughs> Pandy. <laughs> We're at Blue Water. The twins are in their pram. The rest of the team's here. Yeah. And I'm vlogging and pushing the pram. Yay! First day out. First shopping day. Yeah, ever. And first sleepover. Ever, ever. And their first sleepover. And this is how full the pram is. It feels really heavy to push. Does it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at Kevin's little twins. everyone so sorry I'm just shutting the curtains um a few days have gone by and we're now at home I have my extensions put back in and I feel so happy about it it just feels more me um and yeah I love it so much I want to try tonight a heatless um like hair curler kind of thing it's from a brand called Rehab and I saw it on Stacey Solomon's Instagram um, and I think she is like, like owns it I think now um, and I really want to try it because I've seen people's results and they look so good so I want to try that because it's a bit wavy at the minute and I thought if I add like oil and stuff in it should be fine but yeah we're gonna have a little pamper tonight which I'm really excited about um, I made some cookies the other day which I put in the freezer so I'm going to take one of those out. Do you want a cookie, Bradley? Yes, please. Take those out and we can have them. 
um, and I'm gonna have a bath later as well. And we've got some Easter eggs here, <laughs> which I can't say no to. Okay, so me and Bradley for the first time in so long. Um, by the way, I'm like talking more quietly because obviously the twins are asleep. Me and Bradley actually sat on the sofa and watched the twins on the monitor and like watched some telly and stuff. And that is like such a big milestone. So I feel really proud. So I want to curl my hair with the rehab stuff. This is the silk curling, I don't know what it's called, curling curler. The hairbrush, which is really lovely by the way. I think you're meant to do it straight after you wash it and like leave it a little bit damp. So um, I've got leave-in conditioner, which I'm gonna pop on, as well as these hair oils, which are from Rehab as well. Um, and they are so insane. Like the smell of them is incredible. I can't deal with it. So yeah, let's do this. And then I'm gonna do my skincare, get in the bath and then go. So I've slept on my hair, I've just popped a roller in. Um, I've taken some front bits out because it was meant to go in here, but guys, the curl already. I hope it looks nice. I'm just gonna get the twins up.
everyone. So it is my birthday today. Um, I also just wanted to show you guys my hair with using um, with using the heatless curler. I actually can't believe how well it's held in my hair. I've also got extensions in, like I said, and I just, I thought it would go wavy. I didn't think it would be like this, and this is how I curl my hair anyway. So this is honestly a game changer, especially being a mum when you don't have a lot of time to actually curl your hair. Doing it the night before, which takes not even five minutes to put on, it's amazing. Um, so yeah, I love it. I did have to go over the front bits here, but I mean, that took like no seconds at all so this is also my outfit of the day which i've been wearing so much at the minute it's just comfy hello hello what <laughs> i just realized i've got odd socks and do you know what i thought they were the same <laughs> <laughs> that's so annoying in the dark. yeah i did um but we're gonna go for lunch now um get some pizza i think we're gonna go to rockwater the weather isn't that nice i did want to go for a walk along the beach but the weather's not that nice so, i mean we'll see if it clears up by the time we get there and then hopefully we can i'm not sure um but yeah we'll see but that is our plan okay we made it out of the house eventually eventually the twins are here in the back um like i said we're gonna go to rockwater which is on the seafront we always go here i feel like i always speak about it in my vlogs but we love it and it's just easy isn't it with the pram yeah, we yeah. kind of know the vibe there the food is insane they do really nice like fresh food um so we're gonna have stone baked pizzas and the salted caramel flapjack is just my favorite thing i like have a coffee and all that kind of stuff um, and the twins coffee, that jazz. coffee i need a coffee um yeah and the twins really like it there as well so we're gonna do that and then i think we're gonna see my mum and then yeah come home at some point I've just put my hair up in a ponytail quickly um, just because I was sorting out all their bottles and stuff like that and like <laughs> whenever I'm in the zone I just leave my hair out my face but I don't hate it and it's raining a little bit so I'm just going to keep it in it like this until we're kind of in there then I'll kind of decide if I want to take it out and um, oh that's a muddy puddle <laughs> look at that how does it feel that I'm Older than you. Shut weird. <laughs> Toy boy. Yeah. A whole month exactly. I'm older. Uh, how does it feel being a cougar? Feels weird being a cougar. It is weird, isn't it? Like at the minute I'm older. Yeah. So weird. So weird. Anyway, we'll see you guys at Rockwood Day. Anything you want to say? Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. See you soon. See you soon. We are now home from a really cute day. After we went to Rockwater, we actually popped in to go and see my mum, which was really nice. Um, and then after that, we went to, I wanted to go into town because she lives right near town, but the day was just going away so fast that we would have had like half an hour in town. So we thought, no, there's no point. Then obviously with babies, everything takes twice as long. So we thought, okay, 
what else can we do? Because I kind of wanted to have a little mooch around. I don't know, like get myself something for my birthday. Um, so instead we went to TK Maxx because it always closes at eight. So we thought, okay, great idea. Went into TK Maxx. The boys, by the way, they have been angels all day. We managed to put them down in Rockwater. We literally fed them a little bit, like a top up, put them down and they slept. I mean, Brady had our lunch, we had a coffee. Um, it was really nice, but I think we were like expecting them to wake up and they just didn't. So that was really lovely. And yeah, we went into TK Maxx. They were also really good in there. And I just wanted to pick up like, I don't know, like a candle or something for myself. Instead, I found this. The twins got me this, which I need to open, but I found this, and this is like a storage unit. And as you can see on top, it's marble. And then here, it's like gold handles and then ribbed. And this just couldn't be more me. There is a slight chip in it here. And I think with marble, you can't really tell if there's chips, especially from afar, because it kind of looks like the marble. Um, so it was, I don't know what the price was before. It was 90 pounds. Let's try and see what it was before, because this is real marble. So it's obviously really good quality, but I'm intrigued. I need to know. Are you joking? What? I don't know if this is a joke. I saved ten pounds. Really? <laughs> they only took ten pounds off of it. Me and Bradley were like, it must be like a hundred and fifty pounds. They took ten pounds off of it. I mean, I mean, it's better than what it was. But I think I'm going to put this in the main bathroom and put my skincare and stuff in here and just have this like my little self-care kind of unit. Um, so I think I will like decorate and stuff with this in my next video. Like I wanna do loads of house updates. Um, I've also got loads of frames in here. I wanna put pictures in frames. So yeah, I picked this up from TK Maxx. And then I also got a couple of other bits. I can't remember where they are. I've already got a football. Mainly stuff for the twins, I think, isn't it? Yeah. Excuse the mess. This is obviously just our life. Um, I also picked up the other day some bits from George Asda. I love George Asda for baby clothes because it's so soft, it's so affordable, and they just wash really nicely. So I picked up these baby grows. They come in a packet of five, I think, or seven, I can't remember. Um, but there's white and then there's these patterned ones. I love this beige. And then I also saw, they did it in like the stars, navy and blue, and then I just got plain white. Um, and they are now in three to six month clothes. I can't believe it. Like they're just over three months old and they're now in three to six months. It's just it, like it goes so fast. Um, but yeah, I need to pop these in the wash tomorrow. But I wanted to show you guys these because I just thought they're so nice, aren't they? Like the actual patterns and stuff of them and they feel really soft. So George Asda is honestly one of my favourites to shop for like baby stuff. Bradley's over here. Um, I put the twins, well I finished putting them to bed look how nice my dinner looks. and oh, my sister also came around with a bunch of tulips which is really cute um, Bradley's cleaned the kitchen okay so this is Bradley's dinner, What the, is that a lamb shank? Yeah. oh my god and then this is my dinner I've, Thai is my favourite like takeaway, I love it so I have two mains but I like half of them so I have it for lunch the next day um, so this is a chicken masamam curry this is a chicken I think pad thai and then sticky rice and then you get like these little nuts on top and it's just so delicious so yeah we've got a thai for dinner tonight which I'm very excited about I can I really want to try this Bradley this looks like masamam is this masamam masamam lamb you're joking why did you not tell me about this exactly what I'm getting I literally told you. <laughs> what rice did you get? Sticky? Oh my god, stop. It did say it came on a bed of mashed potato. Did it not? Yeah. You got a couple of potatoes? Yeah. Okay, well we're going to enjoy this. Um, and yeah, it's been such a lovely day, hasn't it? It's been amazing. It's been I a really... have had a nice day. I have had a lovely day. Yeah. We've also just put towels in the tumble dryer. It's so funny, isn't it, when you're an adult, like, <laughs> washing up. Getting the kitchen all done, like washing out, is just makes you feel good. <laughs> Adult life, isn't it, Bradley? Yes, indeed. Anyway, I'm going to enjoy my dinner. 